Imagine being born into a royal family, destined to become the first female monarch of your country, and having to balance your education, your duties, and your passions. This is the life of Princess Elizabeth of Belgium, the future Queen of Belgium, who is not just a princess, but a person with dreams and aspirations. In this video, we will explore her lifestyle, from her childhood to her present day, and discover how she lives, studies, works, and plays. Princess Elizabeth was born on October 25, 2001, in Brussels, as the first child of King Philippe and Queen Mathilde of Belgium. She has three younger siblings, Prince Gabriel, Prince Emmanuel, and Princess Eleanor. As the eldest child, Princess Elizabeth is the heir apparent to the Belgian throne and holds the title of Duchess of Brabant. She is also the first female heir in Belgian history, thanks to a new law that introduced absolute primogeniture in 1991. This means that she will inherit the throne regardless of her gender or the birth of any male siblings. Princess Elizabeth's childhood was not very different from that of any other Belgian kid. She attended a Dutch-speaking school in Brussels, where she made friends with her classmates and participated in various activities. She also learned French, German, and English at home and at school. She enjoyed playing with her brothers and sister, as well as skiing, tennis, sailing, and diving. She also developed a passion for music and learned to play the piano. But Princess Elizabeth also had some unique experiences that most kids can only dream of. She traveled around the world with her parents and met many famous and influential people. She visited many countries and cultures and learned about their history and traditions. She also performed some official duties as a member of the royal family, such as attending national celebrations, visiting hospitals and charities, and giving speeches. She also had some special privileges, such as having her own coat of arms, her own scientific research station in Antarctica, and her own naval patrol ship. When Princess Elizabeth turned 18 in 2019, she became an adult in the eyes of the law and the public. She received a special ceremony at the Royal Palace in Brussels, where she thanked her parents for their guidance and support. She also received many gifts and congratulations from people all over Belgium and beyond. She also gained more responsibilities as the future Queen of Belgium. She became eligible to vote, to sit in the Council of Ministers, and to act as regent if her father is unable to perform his duties. Princess Elizabeth decided to continue her education after finishing high school. She enrolled at UWC Atlantic College in Wales, where she studied for two years and obtained her International Baccalaureate Diploma in 2020. She also attended the Yale Young Global Scholars Program at Yale University in the U.S. She chose to study at these prestigious institutions because she wanted to broaden her horizons and meet people from different backgrounds and perspectives. She also wanted to challenge herself academically and personally. In 2020, Princess Elizabeth surprised many people by joining the Royal Military Academy in Brussels for a one-year course in social and military sciences. This was a voluntary decision that she made to prepare herself for her future role as Commander-in-Chief of the Belgian Armed Forces. She underwent rigorous physical and mental training alongside other cadets and learned about military strategy, leadership, ethics, and history. She also participated in various exercises and missions with the Belgian Army, Navy, Air Force, and Special Forces. In 2021, Princess Elizabeth moved to Oxford University in England, where she began studying history and politics at Lincoln College. This is one of the oldest and most prestigious colleges in Oxford, with alumni such as Rishi Sunak, John le Carré, Dr. Seuss, among others. Princess Elizabeth chose this course because she wanted to learn more about the world and its issues. She also wanted to develop her critical thinking and analytical skills. She also joined the Lincoln College Boat Club and rowed for them in an Oxford rowing race. In 2023, Princess Elizabeth continued her studies at Oxford University, where she was studying history and politics at Lincoln College. She also attended the Royal Military Academy's annual summer camps and other practical and theoretical military classes, where she impressed her instructors and fellow cadets with her performance and leadership skills. She also accompanied her father to a reception held at Buckingham Palace the evening before the coronation of King Charles III and Queen Camilla of the United Kingdom. She also attended the wedding of Crown Prince Hussein of Jordan and Rajwa Al Saif with her father in June 2023. Princess Elizabeth's lifestyle is a blend of tradition and modernity. She respects her royal heritage and follows its protocols and etiquette. 
but she also embraces her individuality and follows her interests and passions. She is a role model for many young people who admire her intelligence, courage, kindness, and beauty. She is also a symbol of hope for Belgium's future as a united and prosperous nation. Princess Elizabeth is not just a princess, she is a person with dreams and aspirations. She is not just a future queen, she is a citizen with rights and duties. She is not just a royal, she is a human being with strengths and weaknesses. And she is not just a princess, she is a leader. Thank you for watching this video about Princess Elizabeth's lifestyle. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. And don't forget to leave a comment below and tell us what you think about Princess Elizabeth and her future role as Queen of Belgium. I would love to hear your opinions and suggestions for the next video. Thank you for watching and see you next time on Luxury Freaks.